Yes, the mackerel. Yes, mackerel. I've got mackerel. Yes, the mackerel. Puss fishing tonight. Puss and bass. Yes, here we are guys, at home with the cats. Oh, well, the cats are upstairs. Yes, uh, rig day today again. So this is my little operation at home. I've got all the gear, all the lines. All the hooks, all the blades, all the spinners. Oh, there's me in there. There's me in that blade. Hello. Yeah, so I'm making the um, making more pop-up flounder rigs with the twin holographic blades on this morning. I'll start fishing later. So yes, all I can say is thank you very much for supporting. It's um, it's grown quite a bit. I'm, I'm doing this about, I don't know, 20, 30 hours a week now. I'm making rigs as well as everything else. So uh, yeah, I can't complain. Here we are in the man cave. And here's the rigs, guys. It's, uh, yeah, it's quite a serious operation. Lots and lots of quality rigs. All the stingers, all the pop-ups. All the bling rigs, pop-up pulley place spinner rig, selling loads of them. Pulley place rigs, just in time for play season, selling loads of them. Got some new scratching rigs there, big fish rigs. And I've got the running pats there, pulley rigs. Yes, yes, the rigs. This is keeping me going. Thank you very much. Oh my God, horrific, just arrived. Oh, went a different route on the way up and it, I had to go into Dartmouth for a sandwich and I came back and it took me down these lanes. Oh my goodness, only just made it. Anyway, we are here, Blackpool Sands. Here we are guys, welcome back to the channel. Say hello, iPhone. Hello, iPhone. Yes, it's me, Bassman. I am back, steamed up. Blackpool Sands, Blackpool Sands, the beach, the bogey beach, my nemesis. So yes, I'm here today and I'm um, waiting for Mr. Mingo who's coming up after seven o'clock. So he's coming up to join me. And yes, big baits, some nice big huss, maybe a bass. You know what to do, let's go fishing guys. Yes. Here we are. Here we jolly well are. Oh, that's heavy. Oh. Anyone fancy a sauna? Yes, the sauna. Maybe later. Yes, day after the storm. Very nice. Welcome along. Hello, boy. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I give you the Continental Bass 3.9 set. New from Black Rock, it's coming to the shelves in March, so not long to wait. This, my friends, is very nice. First look. There you go. So this is the new 2G blank 
second generation carbon. How thin is that? Like that. Ultra thin, ultra strong. Very good price point on it. Yes. First time I put it together, really. Yes. There you go, look. Hybrid tip. Very stiff blank. So very light, ultra fast recovery on that one. Yes, very nice. 3.9 meter, casting up to 100 grams, four ounce weight. So yeah, let's get it out there, see what it can do, eh? Let's get a bit of squid out there. Yes, here we are. I have got a double, double cheese and onion sandwich. Some Kong Strong and some fresh mackerel. Yes, the mackerel. <laughs> and in here I've got some defrosting calamari. And I've got some nice crab cart, crab cart that's been in the fridge for two months now, still salted down, lovely look. Yeah, so squid and cart, big squid baits, Big mackerel baits, maybe a mackerel head later when the tide drops. Yeah. And the new bass rod. But yeah, let's get a bait on that and uh, get it out there, innit? And that will do nicely, sir. There we go, running ledger. And a 4-0 stinger rig. Yes, the stinger. Squid's got to be the best bait, the most universal bait out of everything. Anything like squid, everything like squid. Like that. Shove the head on. Wait. What are you doing there, eh? You're not having my mat? No, 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 no. Go on. Right, deep breaths, calm down. The dog nearly peed on my stuff earlier and he had his head in my box for my bait. They're so rude, dogs. They just like muscle in. Like, at least cats come up and like, you know, give it all the you know, waggy tail, you know, the little, they give you all the eye and everything. A dog just steams in and takes your gear, man. It's just, yeah, out of order. Anyway. There we go, in the, in the dying light, one sexy squid. Like that, for a nice bass. And we got a nice bit of cart there. Very gently doing this. There you go, that's it. Ready to rock. 
Right, let's get it out there on the new rod. Yes, the new rod. There we go. Three ounces and bait, no problem. Let's get set up. Right, so I've got a hundred pound, hundred pound pulley rig, so a big fish rig, which I make with an old school 2-0 swivel instead of the pulley bead. So that's 80 pound rig body and a hundred pound hook link. The next rig. So two nice big uh, semicircles on there, look. Yes. So here's my reasonably fresh mackerel. It's better than nothing, I can tell you. Better than frozen. And I'm just gonna go, I'm gonna get two baits out of that. So you've exposed the gut cavity there as well. I might just leave that. like that yes get it out there all right here we are now one of the best husk baits going is mackerel and squid so on the second one I've got the tail of the mackerel like that and I'm just gonna put some squid on there now one of the best combos in fishing. Let's go that way. There you go. One squid mac. Beautiful. So there we go, all, all rods out. Got a little squid on the left hand rod and some big baits on the two big rods. And the, uh, the little Conti is doing pretty well in these lively conditions. Very nice. Big swell out there, big shore dump coming in. Pretty rough out there. And the little rod is hanging on, look. Yes. It's a bit too rough really for this sort of rod, but uh, yeah, just giving it a go. Really thin blank. Really thin, look. Next to the big rod, look. Really thin. With a nice hybrid tip. Comes out in March, guys. This is the only one in the UK. Continental Bass. Hell yeah. And I've just got the bullfrog on there with some 30 pound cheapo braid. There's a bite on the bass rod. Yes, the bass rod. Yes, the bass rod. Here we go, son. It's all about timing. Got to time it on the wave. Here we go. Come on. Yeah. Yes, the Huss. On the new Bass Continental, Sam. <laughs> Cracking Huss, that. Not very big, but yeah, look at the colours on it. So the hook's right in the corner, look on the circle hook 
Yeah, all right, mate. I'm going to let you go. Right there, pinned. Yes, success. Look at that. On the little, on the little bass rod as well. That was quite a good fight, actually. If it was much bigger, I think I might have struggled with that. But yeah, nice, really nice huss. He's only a few pound, I know, but uh, I've not been here that long, and that's on a small squid bait. Yes, really buzzing with that. So yes, welcome along. We are rolling. Yes, don't worry, I'm out with wingman tomorrow night on the bass. Yes, the little huss. Yes. And well, here we are. Finally, a huss from Blackball Sands. The curse is over. All right, I had a couple of small ones, I think, here, but you know, it, it's, a, it's another huss, isn't it? Yes, the curse is lifted. Nice. Right, it's getting back. Get a bigger one. Get his dad. Yeah. Right, time for my rubbish sandwich. Not inspiring. On the new blast, bass rod. <laughs> Good job it weren't much bigger, innit? That's what I was going to say. Is that a dog? How about bigger fish fingers? Is it a dog? It's a dog, innit? It's a dog. Let's have a look, any flaps? Oh, he's got, he's got a bit of a nose on him, isn't he? Yeah. Anyway, welcome along. Hello, sir. Good evening. <laughs> Tell me now. <laughs> Can I poke in your box and see what you're doing? Come on, you've been here five minutes. Poke in your box and I'll poke you back. Yeah. How's it going? I haven't seen you for ages. Good. What's in there? What's in there? <laughs> so, what's your tactics tonight, to Sir Philip of Mingo? Big bait in close. Yeah. And then. Sort of more standard size bait, fired out as far as I can. Nice. Is that a pulley rig, sir? It is a pulley rig with some nice big fat fire those oh, on yeah. there. Oh, yeah. Well, welcome along. I've been here for a few hours. I've had a small husk, it's about three pounds, and that dogfish. Better than nothing. Yeah, it's quite rough. Should fish. Bassy. Yeah, hussy bassy. Oh yeah. yeah, sneaky mackerel. Yeah, good fun on that rod, but uh, I think I'll pack it away now. Concentrate on the bigger stuff, big rods. But yeah, really nice, first go on that. Right, so that bait's knackered. And I've just put this one on. Check that out. And a nice circle through the snout. Come on. It's time for a big huss or bass. Right, so here we are. And here's Phil's hacklet, because I've just lost my, embarrassingly, my last thing of elastic. I've only got knicker elastic left. So he's given me a spool of elastic and he's told me to do that. On the rod rest, you never lose them. However, However. However, how many have you lost when you've taken your rod down? Three. <laughs> yeah. One yeah. must remember to take yeah. the bite. So, it yes, is it, it's a good hack, mate. But, but yeah. at least you lose it when you're going home and not... At, so. least, at least you're honest and said that. <laughs> and you lose it at the end of the night, not at the beginning. Not the, the beginning, night, yeah. That's going, fair yeah. enough. He's got his uh, Ziplex. M4s that he's rebuilt. Sexy orange, Tango. Yeah. Whee! Wait for me! Jason. Wait for me! Jason. Yeah, you were right, it was a bite. Right in the snoot. Right in the snooter. Well, I've not had a bite on that one. So he ain't working, is he? So I've, I've got another rig here to go on. I'm going a bit smaller with this bait. So I've got a nice squid and a, a nice slice of mackerel. So a bit more manageable. 
Yes. I'm sure you said monster. Oh, that's a monster. Specimen Look at that. It's beauty. Wow. I could eat that whole. Husk bait. There we are, just going to tart that up a bit. Me squid and mackerel put some nice fresh crab cart on there, look. How good does that look? Dogfish will love that. Can honestly, honestly say that is the worst, worst sandwich I think I've ever had from a garage. The worst. Spa shop. Horrible. Mm. Here we are, a few hours in. Not a bad night. A few fish. Come on the hus. That is my last attempt. My last attempt. We have been here for, oh, I've been here for nearly five hours now. And just gone dead. So yeah, come on. Have a look in, all right? You're looking sexy, son. Yes, here we are, guys. What can I say? That's fishing. Um, yeah, we tried. We tried, didn't we? Phil's we not certainly been did. Here. Phil's, <laughs> Phil's not been here that long, but... Um... Oh, say that. Look, there's a bite. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's a bite, son. Oh, well, we'll dogs. go back to here anyway. We've, we've had a few dogs and white and stuff, but no big hus. I've had one about, I don't know, three pound or whatever, but yes. Thanks very much for tuning in, guys. We did our best, and we're going to give it another half an hour or so. But yes, hit the like, share the love. See you next time. Thanks for coming up, Phil. Oh, nice to see you, my <laughs> bassing been brother. Been <laughs> My bassing brother from another mother. <laughs> yes, nice one, guys. And Phil's just put me in the darkness again and again. <laughs> <laughs>